Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hi, my name is Lucy. Be sure to subscribe button so you guys don't miss out on my weekly videos. Also guys, if you guys give this video 20,000 likes, I will make another video of testing scary apps that I should not play. But as you guys know, if you have not read the title, today I'm going to be downloading and playing some scary, cursed, and haunted apps that you guys should not download. Like I'm telling you guys, do not download these apps. Let me do it so that I can suffer and play them for you guys. Cause I'm I'm not even sure what's gonna happen, but I'm a little bit scared today. It's already really late. I'm scared. So without further ado, let's just get right into it. All right, guys. So the first haunted app we're playing is Ghost Radar. Okay, I actually had a really scary experience with this app before, and I know that sounds so stupid, but I remember like way back when I was younger, I was messing around with this app before, and I swear something actually touched my leg. I still don't know if it really was real or my imagination, but since then I had not downloaded this app, even though at the time I thought it was 100% fake. However, I found reviews about this app that actually scare me. Let me show you guys. So this person said this was very odd. So before I downloaded this app, I read the reviews. Most of them were saying it was like the real stuff and that it was not a joke. So I decided to download it because I was bored and I have been hearing knocks in my attic, which is above my bedroom. Something about attics just really creeps me out. I used to have a haunted attic too. The first word it said was Henry, so I thought it was probably the name of the ghost. A few minutes later, my friends wanted to hang out, so I told them about the app. They do not believe in ghosts, but they found it interesting anyways. We took a walk in my neighborhood trying to find ghosts. We did find one. The ghost kept going on and off the grid. It kept saying words like close or far, so we thought that it probably meant that we were close to the ghost. After a while, the ghost kept hinting about Pearl Harbor, like harbor or cold or hurt. So we thought maybe the ghost was in the Pearl Harbor. After a while, we were getting a bit bored, so we turned off the app. We couldn't stop thinking about it, which was weird, so we decided to write in chalk all the names that the app said so the ghost could cross out their name. We left for about 10 minutes, and when we came back, nothing was crossed off. So we gave up and tried to forget about it because it was probably fake. Ever since then, everything has felt off. I just feel like I'm missing something. I recommend that you guys do not download it because it could actually be dangerous and you could forget about other stuff. Whatever that might mean. That's actually a really weird review. I actually found some other reviews here which I'm gonna put on the screen so you guys can take time to read them because I know they're long. If you guys do pause and read them, they are terrifying. And like people are saying that it's like actually cursed. This app really does bring in bad spirits. However, I don't like messing with that kind of stuff so obviously I'm going to delete it off my phone and I'm actually not gonna like talk to it. I'm just gonna play it and see what happens and then delete it immediately because I don't want to get cursed, okay? I love you guys, so one like equals one prayer. Okay, here we go. I'm actually so scared, guys. I hate Ghost Radar. Okay, here we go. I'm opening it. Okay, so I'm putting my volume. There's an ad. Oh, that scared me. I was like, well, that was fast. Because, like, the little dots pop up on your screen and they say random words. If it were to say anything about me, I would probably cry. Oh my gosh, there's a dot right there. I'm going to see if I can put it on the screen for you guys. It's, it's gone. It left, but it, it was weird because it was a blue dot and I'm wearing blue. Oh my gosh, I'm overthinking everything. I'm not gonna say anything to it because I don't mess with those things, guys. Nothing's happening. It makes me feel a lot better about this experience. So far, we just have a screen spinning, guys. Insert elevator music here. <laughs> There's no ghosties. Honestly, I feel very blessed right now that that's not happening. Because I have Jesus. It might, not, it might not work for me, guys. Stage. Ah! Ah, it's not a word! It said stage! Oh my gosh, I got chills across my whole body. Angel's scared now. I have chills. And it says blue dot right there. Oh my gosh, because I'm on like, it's almost like I'm on a stage because I'm in front of the camera. And like, it's like I'm performing for you guys. Imagine. Okay, if it says another word, I'm leaving the app. Angel, I'm scared. I need to grab you. Imagine if it said dog. Oh my gosh. Angel, I'm scared. Please, I don't like ghosts. Please. That was a cute yawn. Angel, do you see a ghost? I don't like ghosts. Nothing else is happening, guys. I'm done with that app. I'm deleting it. I genuinely, okay, I actually do have trauma from using that app as a child, so do not play that one. Like, the word stage was enough and the blue dot was enough for me. And I had actual chills. Like, I'm not making it up. My whole body had chills. Next app. Okay, so this next app is called Eat, and there's some really concerning reviews that I found on this app. So this one says, this game is weird. The game at the scary part, you'll eat a squirrel? Why would you eat a squirrel? What did a squirrel do to them? I mean, what the heck? That's not cool. I like 
squirrels. So basically, I guess the whole point of this game is that you eat things. And people are claiming in the reviews that they hear weird creepy noises in the background and that the foods that are on the screen are not normal food. Someone said really creepy. I download this game unknowing of the reviews. I played the game for like 12 minutes and then I started getting weird stuff like leaves, rotten teeth, flesh, which I'd only get when I got the message kill uncle hunger. What the heck does that even mean? Drugs and weird soup pills with red and yellow and the most creepy of all a baby doll which freaked me out. So yeah, like this app doesn't even have like a clear concept. It's basically called eat and all you do is eat. Let's just get into it without even reading much about it and let's just see what happens. Okay, I'm opening the app right now. An application by Crows Crows Crows. Whatever that means. <laughs> Hated that intro. That was the scariest intro of an app that I have ever heard. My ears are bleeding right now. My eyes are crying. Okay, I don't even know how to play this now, but they said another thing that they said about this app, which I forgot to mention, is that if you close it and reopen it, you get new foods to eat. So I'm gonna test that theory as well. It's a cupcake. Yum! That lip smacking though. I hate the noises! The food is tasty, if only there was more! Me every day in the kitchen. What is that? I don't even know what that is. Is that like yogurt with something on top? Dried fruit? Nom 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 nom. Yummy! You continue to eat. You can smell the food. Potato! Nom nom nom! You begin to smile! Why would I smile after eating that? I mean, I don't even like potatoes. Only french fries. Carrots! Ew! I hate carrots and cauliflower. That is nasty, but I'll eat it anyways. Oh no, no. Cold, hard, and empty. <laughs> Why does that sound weird? Okay, a whole basket of fruit. It's like pretty much just giving me a lot of fruits and vegetables. No, 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 no. Do not believe his lies. Whose lies? The heck? What does that have to do with eating food? A croissant! I love croissants. Let us go. Food is waiting for us. What is the point of this app? Bite strong. Why would I eat raw eggs? Hold up, what? That's kind of weird. Okay. I'm gonna exit the app, come back, and see if anything suspicious happens. I hate that intro so much! It goes, And that was a pretty good imitation. I even made Angel mad. Nothing scary is happening. Protect yourself, it says again. What the heck? How did I get that? Screen. Okay, that is a little weird. I've not seen this one pop up yet. I'm gonna eat it. <gasps> what the heck? Exit the app. Okay, that's it. I'm done. That is creepy. I am I am not playing that anymore. It took me that long to get something scary and that happened. I don't know how to feel about that app, guys. I've had enough of that. I don't even know what the point of it is, but that's creepy. Next app. So the next scary app we're going to be playing is Koai Assistant. I actually heard that this app looks normal from the outside, but has a dark inside. I've just seen a lot of weird comments saying just do not play this app. It's very weird. It's very inappropriate. It's very concerning. But let's read some of the comments. So this person said creepy. Never download this app. I said, are you watching me through the window beside me to the Koai Assistant? And she said, yes. Never download this app. Thanks for reading this comment. Well, that's lovely. Um, someone said horrible. This is a horrible game. Someone said is not sexy. Is no sexy. What is it supposed to be? Well, I guess we might as well just open up with no context and find out what happens. Kawaii assistant. Kawaii assistant would like to send you notifications? <laughs> I guess so. Okay, now what? Action icons. Interact with Suki on different screens. Each icon indicates a certain action. Mood meter. Your actions will dictate Suki's mood. Go, let's just start. So she looks like a real human, which is kind of concerning. She wants to access my microphone. Oh no, this is giving me talking Tom, talking Angela vibes. Okay. Hello, Suki. Can she hear me? Suki? Hello? She's ignoring me. What's the wind do? <laughs> Below icon, that sounds weird. Wait, when this icon appears, optionally interact with Suki by blowing on the phone. <sighs> no way! It blew up her skirt? That's so wrong! And she says, stop it! Well, that is not appropriate. What does this one do? When this icon appears, interact with Suki by poking her body? What the heck is this trying to teach children? Stop it! All she does is get annoyed by me when I poke her. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> This is so uncomfortable. What is this? What's the point of this? Is this is teaching harassment. What did she say? Girl, she's mad. She's leaving the room. I don't even know what she said. She left. What is she doing? Where did she go? 
She was like, I'm so done with this girl, I'm gonna get up and leave. Oh, she back. Hope you've learned your lesson! Girl, she is mad at me! She does not love me. Okay, this app is so pointless. It is definitely a little creepy though. I didn't hear anything weird or have anything weird happen. I should ask her one more thing. Yuki, are you watching me? Oh, she's watching me! Definitely, she's like, oh, Chino! Like, I don't even know if I said that right. Oh my gosh, she literally is scaring me at this point. I'm done with her. That app is haunted! Some of the apps you guys recommended are on my screen. I don't know which one to start with. Um, this Slenderina looks kind of scary, and I've never heard of it. But there's also Granny, which I've heard of a lot, and Japanese Doll, which I've also heard of a lot. I think I want to start with Slenderina just because I don't know what I'm going to get out of this one. Alright, Slenderina, what is this app going to be about? I don't even know who Slenderina is. We want this to show ads relevant to you! Um, no? Do they like listen to like me and my everyday life say, Oh, I really like McDonald's and then just throw a McDonald's ad out there? Decline? Slenderina the seller. Oh no. I guess I get to play it now, even though there's a scary face in the dark back of this tunnel. Let's just play it. Seller one? Okay, I guess I have no choice. Easy, medium, or hard? How hard should I take it? I'm gonna go medium, because I'm not sure if I can handle whatever hard is going to be. Okay, so it looks like I'm trying to collect books and get away from something. <gasps> kind of reminds me. Oh my gosh, I know what it reminds me of. Game with the guy with the ruler. You know, that one dude, Baldy. Oh no, if there's gonna be pop-outs, I'm going to lose it. I don't do pop-out games very well, just letting you guys know. <laughs> oh wait, there's a book right there! Okay, cool, I got a book. <laughs> I literally scared my dog! That scared me so bad! I had to grab her! It's just Slenderina, it's not you, okay? I'm scared. I don't like horror games and I didn't know it was gonna be like Baldy but Slenderina. Oh, dude, are you telling me that I have to actually complete this game because I'm going to continue screaming like a big baby this whole time. I hate horror games so much. I'm going on easy mode now. I can't handle that. If that was medium, I don't even want to know what hard is. Maybe this video gets to 20,000 likes. I'll suffer some time and try hard mode, but I was not here for that. And I don't know like how to like get away from her. If I see the blood on the screen, like, is she already there? Like, what's the deal? How do I grab it? Oh, there we go. Okay, she's not here yet. But I'm, like, actually so scared. Because I hate horror games! I hate horror apps. Slenderina. Is it, like, the girl version of Slenderina? <laughs> It's like the Cinderella of Slenderman, right? Maybe, I don't know. Slenderina ain't it, okay? I can't do it anymore. That's horrifying. Ah, don't play that up. Whew, okay, I need to take like a breather after that one, but we are going to go on to the next scary cursed app, which I believe is going to be Japanese doll because I'm feeling like that one for some reason. Oh, okay, so it's in Japanese. I, I don't know what it says, but if anyone knows what this says, please translate it in the comments down below. That's creepy. So there's just like a figure singing a creepy song. I already don't like this. So it says something again, but it's pointing to this flame. So I'm gonna click the flame. Maybe I'm supposed to grab the candles? I hope so. All right, I'm just clicking what it tells me to. Is that a heart? I think I'm supposed to fill up this doll's heart or whatever it might be. This is just so eerie. It's growing. It said something, but like I said, I don't know Japanese. Man, I feel like I can't get the full experience of this scary app because I don't know what it's saying. Ugh. There's a bunch of dolls on like the shelf too. Wait, why is a doll freaking out? What's happening? What the heck? Is that like a bad dream or something? Now I gotta give it a heart again. What is the purpose of this app? I just hate the music so much, but I don't have enough candles. Oh, so you grab the candles and then you fill the heart. Okay, this is making a little more sense now. Why is it doing this? Girl, if this girl was in my choir class, like, I would have yeeted so fast. Just imagine she pulls up the choir one day. Yeah, I don't understand what I'm supposed to be doing. Why does it take so many candles to fill the heart? I want to know what happens after I fill the heart one more time at least. This is the moment I was waiting for. She's growing arms! What? Wait, does it grow a full body? Okay, but I have to play this for hours to get her to grow, though. 
This would take forever. Oh my gosh, no. I'm kind of curious though, but I don't want to like see her forever doing this to like make her grow. Um, this app is creepy though. I don't know if I can handle any more of it. Either way, it's scary. Next scary cursed app we're playing is going to be a ghost detector. Um, I don't know what this one is because I have not played it. Ghost detector radar camera needs to track your activity along other websites. That might be scarier than the actual app itself. They want to track what I'm doing on other websites? Why? I guess, um, allow. It's calibrating my sensors. Okay, ghost detector. How does this work? I'm kind of scared. Start. Upgrade recommended. They're gonna make me pay? Girl! Now they're putting ads on me. Now they want to access my camera? What? Ghost detector radar camera would like to access the camera. You're kidding me. I guess okay, but are they gonna show my face? Ghost oh, they're showing the camera. Walk slowly around, detect supernatural entities. Oh, ghosties! I'm like gonna go this way. Is there any ghosties on Angel? Angel, are you a ghost? I guess not. I'm not finding anything! Am I supposed to find something? Imagine my feet. <gasps> There's a ghost! Ghost signal! EMF, ask a question. There's a ghost right there! Oh, I see it! It's behind the camera! Okay, let's ask a question. We'll click on the what is your name question. It's transmitting. Ah! It's getting a response! This is crazy. What is that language? I am known as Rashnu. That is quite the name. Ask another question. Um, oh, are you good or evil? That's a scary question. Let's ask that one. Imagine it says evil. I delete the app. Receiving response. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't know what that says. What language is that? I am committed to the light. I don't know about that one, chief. Are you alone? Is there more of them? Oh, no. Imagine it's like I'm here with the homies. That's a lot of writing. I hope it's not a pack. Why is he writing so much? I walk alone on Earth, although I have sometimes found counsel with Mirtha, another being of light. There are two of them? No! Okay, this is weird. Well, that was interesting. And last but not least, so many of you guys asked me to play Granny. Granny is a lot like the first app we played, so I'm a little nervous, but I'm gonna do it for your guys' peer entertainment and because I love you guys. I'm scared already because I hate pop-outs. Oh no, I actually have never played the original Granny, like on the iPhone. Allow Granny to track your activity. Why do they all want to track me? What for? Just why? Ooh, her face though! She'd be looking a little scary, not gonna lie. What is nightmare mode? I'm kind of curious, but I'm also kind of like, maybe gonna regret that, but I'm gonna try it. Warning, do not play if you have nightmares. Oh gosh, I'm gonna regret this. Oh no, 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 no. But I'm gonna do it for you guys because I love you guys. Okay, we're gonna play it. Oh no, get out of there. You only have five days. All you need is in the house and be quiet. She hears everything and Granny is crazy. Good luck. Oh no. Okay, I don't even know what I'm doing, but we're gonna play it. This is a bad idea. I already hate this. It's so dark and pitch black and eerie looking. Okay, I'm gonna walk this way. Yup, I'm gonna die really fast. I feel like this is gonna be awful. How do I open it? Oh, okay, like this. I'm gonna go downstairs. There's a dead rat. <gasps> what was that? Oh, Granny is in! No, she's coming for me! <laughs> was that the new record for whoever can die the fastest in Granny? Because if it was, I wouldn't be surprised. I have to leave this house. Yeah. Get out of here! You're so slow! Okay, wait. Is that a thing I can go through? What was that? Dude, yeet! I need to yeet it! Oh my gosh, Granny's right there! No, 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 Nightmare mode, this game is terrible, I hate it. Today we learned two, two things. I was gonna say one thing, but two things. The first thing we learned is that these apps are kind of scary and we should not play them. The second thing we learned is that I am terrible at any sort of horror slash escape game. I am really bad. That's going to do it for today's testing and playing apps that we should not play because they are cursed. Let me know in the comments down below what other scary apps or scary games or videos in general you guys would like me to make on my channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys!